שליח ציבור המקריא פסוקי ברכת כהנים צריך להקריא מתוך הסידור ולא יקריא בעל פה. אזן והצבילי הם עושים אובר לברכת כהנים ולא לדעת הכהנים שהם מפעיל את הם supposed to read from the סידור for two different reasons one because number one it's דבר שבכתב it's uh, something which is written in the Torah and therefore one should not read פסוקים בעל פה ממש שגורים בפי, which could be possible, the Berkat Kohanim might go under that, that guideline that people know it well. In that case, a person could technically say Baal Peh. However, Hazan himself should not. And the second reason is because Hazan might end up making a mistake and cause the Kohanim to make mistakes. And therefore, the right way is that the Hazan should always have a Sidur in front of him and he should be reading word for word from the Sidur and not saying it Baal Peh, even if he knows it by heart. The Hazan should not read it Baal Peh, rather he should read it Mitoch HaKetah. Second important halakha also is in regards to the Hazanim. A lot of time they like to pass on Birkat Kohanim. They want to give it to the next, the guy next to them. Halakha says the right way is that the Hazan himself should say the Birkat Kohanim. It's part of the Hazara and therefore the Hazan himself should say it. If you have a Simcha, or you have uh, some Audrey, you know, something, a good Hazan, and you want to give the Hazan in order to say it, the call with a nice voice, and this and that, then it's mutar. But be'ikar the Hazan himself should be the one to say it, unless he's a Kohen, and he can't say it, unless he's a, he's a Kohen and he can't say it, he should not pass it on to the next person. Again, there's only two exceptions that you can pass it on. Either if you're a Kohen, the Hazan himself is a Kohen, or if it's a simcha and you want to be able to have a nice hazan get up and sing it, in that case you can pass it on. But other than that, the hazan himself should always say it. And always when passing it, even if you're giving it to the next person and he has a good voice or whatever it is, make sure that the person that's saying it is bar mitzvah, he's above the age of 13. Do not give it to children. Don't say, well anyways, it's not a big deal. A little kid could say, no, Anakha says, that ketanim, little children, should not be the ones to be makre, should not be the ones to read the Berkat Kohanim for the Kohanim.